January. It's March 26, 1952, and flashy Southpaw sensation Chuck Davy takes on former lightweight champion Ike Williams. In round three, we see Williams in the dark trunk, trying to get at the will of the West Davy, but he ends up slipping to the canvas. The referee rules it as no knockdown and wipes the rosin off Williams' glove. Davies' opponents have the problem of trying to solve his bewildering southpaw stance and of getting through the screen made by his right-hand jab. So far in the fight, Davy has been piling up points on Williams by using this very weapon. Now watch as Davy gets in two good left hands that sends Williams backing across the ring. Williams is hurt. He has to hold on. Williams, who was lightweight champion during the five years from 1947 to 1951, is now trying to move up to the welterweight division. But tonight, he must get past the sensation of the welterweight ranks. Ex-collegiate champ Chuck Davy, undefeated in 31 professional fights with 22 knockouts. Williams again with two short laps. The ex lightweight champ is now trying to last the round, but Davy won't let up his attack. After another series of punches, leaves Williams to fumble on the ropes. The referee steps in and stops the fight. Chuck Davy takes another giant step in his quest for a shot at Kid Gavilan's 